Okay. Time to meet Takamura, baby. I do not understand. Does the Rasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Suits know one spark's all it takes for Japan Town to go up in flames. Riots are always best put down. Oh my god, dude. Why? My folks not spoiling your brand name. Ah, you are here. Yeah. There's no time to waste, B. Okay. Bro. Goro, good to see you. As it is to see you, B. I acquired some information. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Your is a smart little muffin. Putting on the parade to show off his attachment to Arasaka, its values. 
and to solidify his legitimacy. He is shrewd. I will not deny that. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and I will see in them a hidden message to his foes. What message would that be? I am here, Gumin Domo. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Where'd you get this shard? Across the canal. Kabuki? <laughs> Might actually be half-decent soft then. And if it isn't, got a few tricks up my sleeve too. This is good to know. Let us move on. To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. I think I see where this is going. Got me doing all the dirty work. Do you wish to trade places? What exactly would you say to her? Hello, my name is V. Hanako-sama knows me. Only I can do this. I and now, it. what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work, I will watch your back. Now, get to it. V? Fucking worked.
and it does have glitches, but who cares? Nothing's perfect, you know. Done. System's ours. The shot works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that. Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. It's tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Sokka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. He's not on his A-game, sure. Even without implants, he could decommission us easily. Where's that come from? Ever seen him in action? No, just no. From the way he walks, the look in his eye. We'll come back to this later. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One. We break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half. We hack Hanako-sama's float. Two. During the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three. I get onto the float. Four. I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things are even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let him off his leash. Let him stray, even a couple of... a stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. 
and you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Cook! Louder! Louder! Your flesh. President Myers has called this a He eliminated the last obstacle between himself and the complete the power. And they the surrendered it to me. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. So. There's no time to waste. Oh, death me. must have really fed the flames between the different factions. That is exactly what happened. And what's the balance of power look like now? Keiji longs for stability. The old order, they are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato, support Michiko-sama, Saburo's granddaughter. I know little about her. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about them some other time. Where's Yorinobu's rebellious streak come from? No one knows this. Perhaps soon I shall ask him in person. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at the critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu. For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Damn. Wait, think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think... God damn it! We are all to blame. Oh my god. We allowed ourselves to be tricked. But we will correct this soon. Will you join me? There's no time to waste, B. Shut the fuck up, man.
Don't fucking go, baby. Nice. Okay, here we go. Sure. Why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. That's not how you get them to speak. You have to have a toy. Come. I have found a good place to observe. We must just climb up here. Why do you wait? Now, this way. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much. Hmm, perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Let's do this. There's no time to waste, B.
trucks drive up regularly. Are we to hijack one? Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last result. I do not wish to die there. Pipes. See him? We could use them to get inside. This is not bad. I think I've seen everything. You wish to come for this reconnaissance, do your job. I expected you to be more useful than this. All right, quit moaning. I'll give it another glance. Got eyes on the comm system. A lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. Antenna. Security hub is liable to be in that building. Perfect for sabotage. Transformer by the wall. See it? We should use it to step up. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So, we going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in then. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. <coughs> Fear. What? No sudden movements. Do you see it? Like that? Fine-looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a back and echo. A back and echo? What's that? It is a cat spirit. It brings misfortune. Can restore the dead back to life. Believe in ghosts? The relic let you talk to the dead, does it not? I believe we are past belief. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, B. 
back in Echo 2. Where'd you grow up, anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once, when I was desperate to leave there, I... Uh, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. My childhood? Let's see. Nights spent looking for a star. Any star. All dimmed by city lights. Silent lullabies sung by the flickering neon signs of Charter Hill. I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. Let me guess, so they could turn them into Corvo soldiers? Exactly. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. All you had to do in return was kill Saburo's enemies. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend, Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Wasn't judging you. And true, you opposed the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way. Yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world in its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists. As if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability, safety... Chief Eleven slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that, too. We cannot fix everything at once. Forgetting I was at Arasaka, saw how corpse operate. It wasn't roses and rainbows. And you know what? Nobody owns me. I'm free. You should try it. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world, forget everything. Nomads aren't lone wolves with egos. Whether they're blood or not, family comes first. Yes, but we need not quibble over details. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompeki. We both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this. So we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Finally starting to make some sense. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or she'll make sure we die for good. Bakaneko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. I think it is time to do something. Hmm? Oh, fuck, get worse. You do not look so bad.
prisoner reaction. That is my duty. I mean. Good. Now try to enter the warehouse. I will draw their attention away. Mm, rather clever. That's why I'm here. Very well. I have reached the roof. I'll be in their communication system soon.
gotta reload that cuz that was some bullshit. That was some bullshit. What the hell? What the fuck? Is on that? sight. Yes, I heard. I'm on sight. You want to be quiet? Things yeah. didn't go. Oh, exactly is planned. What the fuck was that shit? What the hell y'all saw that? The car just disappeared. Who will take care of my mama? What? that I just didn't get a job as a delivery guy. I could sure have turned leaf, man. I'm in. Good. Now try to enter the warehouse. I will draw their attention away. Rather clever. That's why I'm here. Very well. I am restored. I'll be in their communication systems soon. 